be slim to be pretty. You don't have to be skinny to be pretty. I didn't say skinny. You can have a, be you can have a bigger stomach and still look pretty. Here you go. The body that the vacation is about to get is 175 with, with some little dinner roll, a little, little roll down here, and a little couple, like one back roll at the back. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Um, just to just hop in into the vlog. Y'all not seeing double. This is a brand new vlog. But um, I want to give a special shout out to a specific company. They're currently sponsoring today's video. Just a little background between me and the company. Um, I'm y'all know I'm only six months, six and a half months, um, to be exact, into my YouTube journey. And this was the first company that believed in me. Um, like I said, I've gotten a couple of sponsorships here and there throughout my journey. Yes, already. So I feel very blessed to say so. And this company, like I said, I had, um, if y'all watched my previous vlogs, I reached out this, to this company when I first started my journey in YouTube, and or on YouTube, excuse me. And they reached back out to me, um, I wanna say about three months ago. So I've been working with this company for about three or four months. Um, it's going about three months now. And um, today's sponsor is Fetch Rewards. So thank you to Fetch Rewards for sponsoring this video. Um, yeah, I just love this company. Well, it helps people all over um, that, you know, that are going through this inflation. You know, if you're grocery shopping, if you're buying gas, you know, everything is very expensive. And I'm just giving those two things as an example. If you're traveling, if you're buying things that you need, if you're buying things that you want. So what Fetch Rewards does, you know, like for instance, I went grocery shopping uh, recently and I went to about a couple of places. I have like Food Town and Walmart here. And then I went to HEB, you know, I don't have that. I think I have HEB over here somewhere, the receipt for that. And I'm getting ready to scan those. And how Fetch Rewards works is that you take your receipts, you scan them on the app, or you, they, it pulls from your email too. So if you're ordering any items from Amazon, if you have any digital receipts that's coming from any retailer, they will pull from your email and they will add to your points balance. If you enter my code Eyes of Jess, make sure you click the link in the description box and you enter my code Eyes of Jess, you get your first 3,000 points on me. And like I said, those points rack up and they turn into gift cards, okay? So also just to add a little uh, bonus to that is that certain items add more points. So for instance, the other day, I think I was buying a snack for my daughter and she was telling me, oh my God, when I was scanning it on your app, mom, I saw that they gave us more points from ordering or buying this certain item. And I was like, what? And if you look on the app, you just take your time, scroll through the app, it'll tell you certain items that give you more points. And and sometimes I went to the store, I went to HEB the other day and it gave me 725 points, okay? And that was just for grocery shopping. I spent like a hundred something dollars in there and got 725 points. So enter my code Eyes of Jess for your first 3,000 points on me and happy shopping. Alright y'all, and on to the vloggy. Yeah, I got one Virgil, got one in that dance, the only two, man. How many times have I shown and proved? Because <laughs> y'all probably didn't hear nothing I said because of the A song. But I was just talking about my skincare, my skincare routine and how, you know, everything's been working for me recently. You know. But anyway, what I got on, these glasses are from BD. They're giving me dirty. I might have to wipe. I might have to wipe them with the lens. But I got these glasses from BDs. These are some cat eye sunglasses. They're very cute. Um, and then I just have on like a scarf um, tied around my head. A messy bun. Some some hair in the front. Um, these all the jewelry that I have on is from that store from Harvard. I have not made it back there. I was supposed to go. I was supposed to go this week and I have not made it. So we're gonna go probably when I get back from vacation because I ain't got the time. Uh, I'm about to get rid of 
real busy. Um, I work the week before I go on vacation, so I ain't got time to be driving on the other side of town looking for some jewelry. I already have jewelry anyway, and I'm already been packing to as well, and I'm gonna be gone for a whole entire week. I'm gonna be back until either that Sunday or Monday. I don't know if I'm gonna pick up the camera either until like getting close to when school starts. So I'm just letting you guys know that the next vlog after this one will be the vacation vlog and after that it's going to be a little break because school is about to start and as y'all know that the ride, the pandemic is back among us, it has still been among us but um, the cases are rising again in my city. I live in Houston, Texas and people out here they don't listen um, as far as all the protocols that we should have taken. Having a great time, and that's what matters to me. 
cares if they talk about me? Oh, nobody shouldn't be talking about me because I'm still gonna look better than them. I'm just saying, like, I don't know why y'all care so much about a perfect body for vacation. Because we want to look and feel good in our clothes. But you should feel good already. That means you're insecure. And that's not good. Baby, I'm not insecure. It's the other YouTubers that be insecure. Then why, why you gotta care so much about having a, having a type that certain type of body? You don't have because to be, I know what my you don't know. You don't have to be slim to be pretty. You don't have to be skinny to be pretty. I didn't say skinny. I didn't say skinny. You, okay, I just so know my stomach can be what it is. I just, know my stomach can be small. You can have a bigger stomach and still look pretty. Don't don't invalidate yourself. Oh no, I'm just saying. I just be seeing other YouTubers, and they be and acting they like need, they need to stop that too. No, y'all, I agree with her. I was just really trying to make the conversation. I agree with my daughter. I really agree with her. Like y'all gotta stop all that. Y'all know I promote confidence on this channel. And y'all give y'all vacation with body, y'all can give it, okay? Now, if you know your potential for your body, I say go for it, but don't stress yourself out, okay? That was the message I was trying to convey just now, so. Okay, y'all. Yeah, I think y'all can see it. Okay, skin. Anyway, we just left Starbucks. I got the pink drink. I usually get the pink drink because it doesn't have any dairy in it. It's just coconut milk, and I got it blended this time. That usually be the drink. Before I was a YouTuber, I used to get pink drinks all the time. Um, but like I said, Starbucks, it still has sugar in it. So that's why I don't go often. But anyway, we're not going to go into details. But the pink drink is 140 calories. I think it's 140 or 190. I can't remember. I'll put it on the screen. Calories, yeah. My daughter, she got the what is it? Dragon fruit refresher. Yeah, the mango dragon fruit refresher. And her hers was 90 calories. So this is what I ordered, and I got it blended, light ice. And so yeah, I put it right there so y'all can see it. All right. And then my daughter, you want to show your drink again so they if they didn't see it. So we pink and purple today. to the mall. <laughs> I need to make a return at Bath and Body Works. It's probably going to be an exchange, y'all. I ain't going to even hold y'all. <laughs> I count the money, man, I'm already rich I go so hard with these riches I fell in love with the dirty. I fell in love with the rolling Wake up and pray every morning Demons, they calling my soul I say fuck all of you hoes I'm ballin' out of control 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 huh? Alright, so we just left the mall Get in the house. Oh, the lip gloss that I have on is a mixture of Dior plumping gloss and coral and the Fenty. I forgot what it's called, but I'll put it on the screen. Or I'll link it in the description box. Goodbye. Anyway, so we made it in from the mall. 
I made it in the car from the mall. So I just wanted to pick y'all back up and check in with y'all. Got some items from Bath and Body Works. Well, not even for now. I still ain't make my return yet. I will in a second. I'm gonna go to another Bath and Body Works. I got my free birthday gift from Sephora. I'll show y'all all that later on when I do a little haul. But for now, I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my weekend. I don't think I'm gonna pick y'all back up anymore today. Um, probably no more tomorrow either. But I'll talk to y'all on Sunday. Good afternoon, darling. And happy Sunday. Um, so I don't know if I told y'all um, in the vlog, I'm getting ready to get out the car, um, that I will be going out for quite some time, only because around this time next week, I'm gonna be out of the country. And I don't know if I told y'all, but the cases are rising out here in Houston. And I'll be doggone if, I mean, if I go out and get the, the virus, or if I do anything that I'm not supposed to or be close to people and I get the virus, I'm gonna be mad because it's gonna ruin my trip. I take my actual test on Saturday morning. So I'm not doing anything. So y'all wanna guess where I'm at right now? One of my favorite places. You wanna see the show? Let me put on my shades because I'm about to get out of the car. I'm about to show y'all all oh, these shades. I think I got these from like, I don't know, the beauty supply place, I think. Or maybe a uh, rainbow, I'm not sure. But let me show y'all where we at. We're at Kava, my favorite place. Try to film as much as I could. I was focused on what kind of bowl I was getting this time. So I got the mix. I got the, um, I, I always do the build your own. I don't get the bowls that's made for me. Um, but I got this mix of grains and greens this time because this is my first time eating and it's 5 p.m. I'm very hungry. The last time I ate a meal, and I'm talking about ate for real, was yesterday at like 2 p.m. Yeah, not recommended. I got, of course, like I was saying, I got, and y'all know I act the food, so I got a whole bunch of straws and stuff like that. I should have got me a drink, but I'm just gonna get me a water in the car. I have a water in here, so. That should be fine. And I don't know if y'all could tell, but I'm actually going to the pool. I'm gonna eat. I got me something to eat real quick, and then I'm gonna just go to my pool and just relax. But there's my bowl, and like I told y'all, I get a different bowl every time because I'm building my bowl. So, um, I got the, I got all the vegetable, uh, vegetables. I got all the vegetables except for the avocado. Avocado has a lot of calories, y'all. I'm not going to get that. The bowl already itself, you're building a bowl. So you're going to put a lot of calories and I'm already adding grains. So I didn't want the avocado, but I got all the other veggies. I got the olives. I told her to be heavy handed with the olives. I got the shredded romaine and my mix that I got was the greens and grains and I got the super greens mix and I forgot I think I got like the brown rice I'm not too sure I think I think that's what I see and I got the half grilled chicken half um harissa chicken and um feta cheese pickled cabbage cucumber tomato red onion I see cucumber i said that i don't know and the dressings i got was the hot harissa dressing and the greek vinaigrette so i'm about to tear this up and the next time y'all see me i'm y'all gonna see me at the pool yeah so open up <laughs> So, 
We are at the pool, as y'all seen. And I decided to bring the rest of my kava here because I'm just on that vibe. I'm going to go ahead and take off my cover up because I'm hot. It looks like it's going to rain, y'all, though, so I don't know. Oh, well. It's a few people at the pool. It's not that many. Okay, so I got my cover up off because I was kind of hot. Let's see these tan lines. Chill. I got my coffee. I only ate like maybe 10 bites and I decided to come outside. So, hope y'all can hear me. So that's what we doing for the rest of the evening. Um, I wanted to ask y'all, have y'all seen that movie Nope yet? It's this guy that's been trying to take me for a few days now and I told him that I'll probably go see it when I get back from vacation. Um, but I heard the reviews are bad for the movie. So I still wanna get my own opinion. I don't really go by people's opinion because I'm kind of weird and I'm a movie buff. And it's some things that people don't like when it comes to movies that I like. So I'm definitely gonna check that out when I get back. Y'all, I'm gonna be gone for like, how many days? Nine days. I think it's nine days. Yeah, I'm gonna be gone for about nine days. I wonder if y'all can guess what I'm doing or where I'm going. Comment down below and guess where I'm going. It's a such thing as three answers. It's a such thing as one answer. But it's out of the country. It's not in the United States. I'm, I've traveled a lot of places in my life before I was a YouTuber. I've been to Vegas three times, four times, excuse me. I've been to New York. I've been to New York once. I took my daughter for her 11th birthday back in 2018 no 2019 excuse me i've been to florida like six times all over up and down florida i've been to california about 10 times i'm never going back to california y'all unless i get paid to go there i don't like california i like northern california like napa um i like san francisco but i do not like los angeles i think it's very dirty and boring there I did appreciate Rodeo Drive though. Um, and I like, yeah, I like Beverly Hills, of course. Louisiana, of course, that's my favorite state. I have family in Louisiana. Um, I definitely wanna go to Chicago. I've never been to Chicago. I've been trying to get to Chicago for a few years now, but things be popping up, like things be happening. So I'm like, uh-uh, you know what I mean? But I heard Chicago is pretty nice. Like, they have nice areas. I'm pretty sure I will stay in the nice area. <laughs> the international countries I've been to, I've been to the Bahamas. Mexico, I've been to Mexico like 10 times. I've already been to New Zealand. I've been to Fiji. But I definitely, these are the, those are the places that I've been to. Um, I definitely want to go to, um, as far as in the U.S. concerned, I definitely want to go to like the Carolinas, uh, New York again. I want to go to New York again. I definitely want to go back to New, New Orleans. That's my favorite place in Louisiana. But as far as international, I want to go to St. Lucia, Bora Bora, Croatia, split Croatia to be exact. I want to go to Seychelles. Um, where else I said I want to go? Of course, I want to take that tour of Europe where you go into those few countries. I definitely want to go to Europe. Um, I definitely encourage y'all to guess where I'm going to go <laughs> on my 2022 vacation, my big vacation. And it's, it's not what you expect because I had to make some changes. It's not what I really wanted to do, but in the end, it happened the way I wanted it to happen. So that's fine. And I think this is the best route for me to go on a vacation. So... Um, next year I'll be I already actually planned on going on four vacations two international vacations and two domestic vacations um, yeah one every quarter comment down below and guess where I'm going 
<laughs> That'll be cute. I need some interaction in my comments, y'all. I don't want y'all just interacting with me when something happens to me negatively. Talk to your girl. Talk to y'all. know y'all trying to get to know me and stuff like that. But like I said before, I've, I've traveled and lived a life prior to YouTube. So I know y'all still getting to know me and it looks like that I haven't been anywhere yet because I just started YouTube this year. So anyway, I'm about to, oh, y'all want some of this? There's a lot on this support. I got some super greens on here, feta, and one piece of cheese. Here you go. workout was intense as usual um, I think I sweat off everything that I indulged in this weekend I told y'all what I had jeez oh my god anyway I feel very accomplished um, for those who are new here y'all know I'm on a fitness journey and stuff like that I ain't gonna go into it ain't gonna be no long conversation okay Cause some of y'all that subscribe, uh, y'all might, y'all might have heard this before, but uh, I burn a lot of calories a day. That's why I love working out. Like I burn, it's crazy, but I burn like over a thousand calories. Um, and let me tell you why. I might make a video about this. I think I will, but that's why I'm not gonna go into detail. But I be burning like half a pound sometimes, if not more in calories so i don't know if y'all know but a pound is 3,500 calories if you're burning say a half a pound every day and you're working out six days or seven days a week you're you're burning a whole bunch you're burning pounds you're you're losing weight for real um the only thing that you need to be in control of is the food you eat and you good that's why i really don't necessarily worry too much um, when it comes to me getting back on track, y'all, I need to wipe this sweat off. Um, I don't have no towels with me. Oh, Jesus. Anyway, we just got to thug it out. Um, thank God I'm going straight home. I'm not, I'm going home. So I can, you know, just hop in that shower and that's that. Um, but anyway. Um, am I eating? Like I said, I've been on birth control, so my stomach has suffered the most on my birth control not my mass or anything just my uh, stomach but when I get back on track I get back on track and you can tell you can tell like I look really really good like for a good week and then like that one or two days after the week I'm bloated because of birth control and sometimes I bleed on the birth control because I'm just I know this TMI but sometimes I bleed on the birth control because my body is still getting adjusted to it it's on its fourth month and uh, yeah so that's that my body is still trying to get used to that hormone anyway y'all i just wanted to let you guys know that's uh why i'm i love working out so much y'all know i weight train first and then i do cardio and this is all fasted i do not eat before so when i get home i'm gonna make me something to eat um and it's literally um, gonna be in my eating window also for you guys that has been subscribed to me, I don't know if y'all remember, but I used to tell y'all that my eating window was between five to nine. And I usually don't even eat after eight anyway. Well, ever since I started weight training, I have to put more calories in my body because I'm like I just said a few minutes ago is that I burn a lot of calories. And weight training makes you very, very hungry, especially when you fast before it. Like I literally drink water and a C4 before I go do anything um, as far as like weight training and, and cardio. So just imagine how hungry I am. Um, some people, they like to eat before they work out, but to me, eating before you work out weighs you down. It's recommended, but my body has always been in a fasting state to where it doesn't bother me 
if I don't eat. And I'm not a breakfast person either. When I when I eat breakfast, that's because I craved breakfast. Hey y'all, so it's the next day. I'm about to try on some swimsuits, y'all. And don't mind this hair, it is not done. It ain't done, trust me. Um, I'm about to see what I can do to it. That's why I have it on, um, but it's not applied. I just have it on my head so I can figure out what I'm gonna do to it. Um, I'm not gonna cut it in a bob or anything. I don't know if I wanna wave it, but we're gonna see. But child, that's besides the point. Um, we're about to get to trying on a few. I'm gonna show y'all. Well, I already tried on all my swimsuits and how it's gonna look with the cover-ups, but um, I'm gonna try a few of the swimsuits for y'all on camera. Um, I'm gonna try on probably maybe two or three, not sure yet. But yeah, yeah, I hope y'all are doing well. But let me show y'all the problem that I have. I actually have a problem. It's, I don't think it's a problem. I think it's like an addiction. But um, then again, it's, I don't know. Like, I don't think it's that bad of an addiction. So y'all know that I'm gonna be gone for about seven days, seven nights. That's what it's looking like. Seven days, seven nights. And yeah. I kind of overdid it. Okay, y'all, I think I have a problem. This is sick. So I'm going for seven days and seven nights. I have these, these joints, these right here, 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 these, 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 and these. And guess what, y'all? I'm taking all of them. So this is not my whole entire sunglass collection at all, by, by a long shot. This is nothing but like maybe 25% of my sunglass collection. Today, I counted my sunglasses. I have 100 sunglasses, y'all. It's sad. And I feel like I don't have enough. Like, I want some pink ones. And I have some white and pink ones right here, but I want some pink ones. Yeah. And then, y'all, these are all the swimsuits I'm bringing. All this, these are the cover-ups over here. And these are the swimsuits. So I'm bringing a total of 13 swimsuits. I think it's 13, let's see. I have three um, one-piece uh, swimsuits and they have like cutouts. Like this is like a cutout in the middle here. This is a super deep cutout. Like it's just, you know, I'll show y'all that one. Probably, I probably won't show y'all that one until vacation. I'm not sure if I'm gonna show that, that one. Um, this is a one piece and let me tell y'all where this is from this I think this one is from I want to say Macy's it's look it's giving me Macy's and it has like all these different color leaves on it and this one is from Charlotte Russe I know that for sure this one is from um, Forever 21 of course y'all seen this one before this is from Charlotte Russe this one is from Burlington. So this is two piece. Y'all remember seeing this with the one shoulder. Y'all need to go back to my first swimsuit try on haul on my channel. And I tried this on. This is like a purple one shoulder. And this one has like the little cuts in the middle. This one is from Burlington. I'm not too sure if I'm gonna try this one on today, but this one is really cute. I only wore this one once. This is from Walmart and it's giving me like pinup girl vibes cause it's like a full fledged bra. But how it's shaped is so cute. Ooh, I got a little itch. Ooh. But how it's shaped is so cute. It kind of um, goes in in the middle. And it, it has like a super high-waisted. And it has like the cutouts on the sides. This one y'all seen in my first swimsuit trial and haul. This is like a polka dot brown color. It's like a nude. This is my nude. This one, this is, uh, this has the scrunch booty like this one. It's similar to this one. The bra part is bigger or the top is bigger. Um, and yeah, it ties like that. It's similar to this one, except this one is bigger. I wish I would have got this one in a, small, in a smaller size, but I've been had this one soon, so. Um, this one is from Walmart. Oh yeah, so y'all know this is from Walmart. This is from Walmart. This is from Burlington. This is from Walmart. This one is from Walmart, and this fits me very, very well. And this is similar to this one and this one. But, yeah. 
So, and this one has different cutouts on the side. So does this one. This one has these type of cutouts on the side. This one doesn't have any cutouts on the side. And this one has this cutout. So this is kind of similar to that one. This is a straight up bikini top. And then the bottoms, of course, are stretchy. And it has like a couple of cutouts. So this is pretty cute. This is Royal Blue. This is from Walmart. This is also from Walmart. Y'all have seen me try this one on in my first one to try on haul. This is from Walmart, but this was supposed to go with like some. This is uh, this is from a set. The bottoms are just like this. The same color, monochromatic, hot pink. But I wanted to wear it with these bottoms. And I've been having these bottoms for a while. And they are similar in style. These tie on the sides. And this one tie on the back. Like that. You see what I'm saying? Like it's similar. And it looks cute because it has the hot pink in it. So that's how we ran that one. And this one, this orange one, is also... Oh, this is from Walmart. Both pieces are from Walmart. This is from Walmart. And that's from Walmart. This is from Walmart as well. The only thing I don't like, this top part... This is my favorite swimsuit. But this top part is too big. My boobs are not that big anymore. I bought this swimsuit when I was 260 pounds. Yes. And this top... The bottom still fit good because I am always have like a big butt and big hips but they fit better now than what they've done in the past because i was bigger and it has like the big cutouts on the sides these are high-waisted so these are really cute but the the bra part i wish i think what size is this i gotta cut out the tag i'm pretty sure this is giving xl or maybe large if i had this in a medium it worked but i'm gonna tie really really tight and this is a two-part swimsuit because it's a halter or you can detach the uh, straps and wear it as a bandeau top. So I might try this on for y'all. I think that's going to be the first one I try on. But this is the bandeau swimsuit. Um, as y'all could tell, you can do this in a halter. You can do it to where you want to tie it like that. I think that's very cute. Y'all could tell that the top is too big. It's, sh it's showing like I don't have much chest. So I might just kind of... I'm going to have to finesse the crap out of this swimsuit. Because it's making my chest look flat. But yeah, you could do it like this. Or you can just not wear the straps at all. Just imagine these not being on the swimsuit. So, um, so we're just going to put them there for now. But let me show y'all the bottoms. So the bot oh don't mind that mess over there. That's my rack and it's got some shoes. But these are the bottoms. They're pretty high waisted. Um, y'all know my hips are up here. Y'all seen I got a little thicker. But yeah, they're pretty high waisted. It has like the little cutouts on the side. Y'all know the vibes. Hold on, they kind of they not right. right okay, now. sorry y'all. My alarm cut us off. But anyway. They had like the little cutouts in the side. Yeah, there we go. And I think this is really cute. Like I said, y'all, I'm gonna have to figure it out on the top, but the bottom's okay. I'm not turning around, okay? But this is what we looking like. Cute. Very, very cute. We gonna see. I might have to wear it full and not wear it as a bandeau, but I really wanted to wear it as a bandeau. And the cover up that I wanna wear it with is this one and let me show y'all this cover up y'all gonna be like girl oh my god yes so i got this from rainbow the other day and the price it was 25 dollars total as far as the regular price i got it for 10 dollars. i don't know if y'all can see that focus 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 and look y'all it's a jumpsuit it's a jumpsuit so it's those jumpsuits that are in style, but knitted jumpsuits, and it's wide leg. So it goes all the way down to the ground. I will show y'all. Well, the wide legs don't go all the way down to the ground, but it's long enough for me, and it's very stretchy. I literally could have gotten like, what is this? A XL? I literally could have got this in a large, but I want it to fit a little loose. So, yeah. This is how it looks, and it has like that little hole in the front that wraps around like it, it goes like that. It's so cute. If I was to wear this swimsuit 
and this cover up, I would wear probably these glasses with it. Yes, the orange swimsuit, the baby blue glasses, and this cover up. I'm going for colorful looks. Um, on this vacation nothing i don't i think i only had like one look that i'm gonna do monochromatic but then again i don't think so so none of my looks will be monochromatic as far as my swimsuit looks so this is a plus side try, try on haul i am not a small girl okay we didn't got thick over here okay 175 look good on me so the body that the vacation is about to get is 175 with, with some little dinner roll, a little, little roll down here, and a little couple, like one back roll at the back. That's what this vacation gonna get. So next swimsuit. Okay, y'all, so this next swimsuit, I definitely can't turn around. This one is very, very sexy. Even though it's a one piece, y'all, it is very, very sexy. I got, oh, I don't know, did I tell y'all that that orange one is from Walmart, right? So yeah, but anyway, this one is very, very sexy. I cannot turn around. But this is how we're looking at, at the top portion. <laughs> I don't know if I can show you the bottom, but this is what the bottom looks like. <laughs> but yeah, it's very, very sexy. So this is the bottom. Look, I can see it. I cannot turn around. This is what the bottoms are looking like. Yeah, I'm definitely not turning around. It's cute. It's giving. It's giving something, child, but it's giving. Please do not demonetize me, YouTube. <laughs> and the cover up that I'm probably going to wear with this one, it's an array of cover ups that I want to wear with this one. Probably going to wear this one. I got this one from Dee Dee's. Oh, this one's still this one Forever 21. I got this cover up for $5.99 at Dee Dee's a long time ago. I think last year I wanted to wear it in Cabo. And I think this would be cute over it. I know y'all can't see the vision, but it'd be cute over it. And how it is, like, it's pretty short. Like, because my hips is going to swallow this up. So, I'm probably just going to cut the sides so it can show body. You know what I'm saying? You see how, what I'm talking about, the vision? Like, it'll show my hips. So, I will cut the sides and it can just show my hips. Yeah, this is a sexy one. I'm thinking about wearing this one in the nighttime. This, yeah, I can't turn around. It's going right up my butt. I don't know why my camera keep cutting off. But anyway, next swimsuit. Okay, so the next one is one of my favorites. Like, I'm trying all my favorite ones that I'm bringing. And, of course, y'all already seen the other favorites because I already tried them on in my first try on haul. So, I'm bringing those other favorites, too. But this one, I literally just took the strap and put it over here. That's probably how I'm gonna wear it. Now, I can get away with wearing this swimsuit with this cover up. Unfortunately, these are not the same greens and I don't wanna do that. I'd rather wear the orange one. So y'all comment down below and y'all tell me what y'all think. I also have this cover up, but this doesn't look like it's lime green. It just looks like a seafoam green. But the cover up that I really want to wear with this is the pants because the top, like I would want to wear a top, the top is a top. These are the pants, the swim pants that I got that I want to wear with this. Cause look, y'all see the splatters of lime green. Okay. And I was going to just wear some black slides cause it has black, you know, detail, black slides, probably black glasses, or I might wear, let me show y'all. I might even bring them out and wear these glasses, which I'm pretty sure I am because it has orange in here. Like I said, I'm doing pops of colors. I'm taking colors out my uh, cover-ups and I'm just going to match with my glasses. I think that's very unique, y'all. So if y'all don't like that style, that's fine. But I know it's going to look good because I've tried it and it looks really, really good. Okay. So these cover-up pants I got from Rainbow. These were a regular price. Let me remove this little sticker so I can see. These were regular price $9.99. And they are flare leg. And of course they're mesh. Why did I get them for $3? And I actually brought these on New Year's Eve this year. So I purchased these on New Year's Eve. And you see how it has the lime green, green, 
green splatters in them. So cute. So, let me show y'all the full swimsuit. So y'all can see what I'm talking about. So, this is the swimsuit. I don't know if y'all can see it. I need to get these walls repainted. Because this is oil splatter. Let me tell you what it is. It's this. This is Dr. Teal. I splattered it a little bit on the wall the other day. And yeah. But this is the bottom. I cannot turn around. Let me show y'all. I don't know if y'all can see. These are the bottoms. I cannot turn around. I told, I told y'all I have a short torso. So it makes it look like I have a big stomach. And I don't but look how cute this is i think this is very very cute and sexy too i cannot turn around this is going right up to my butt right up my butt <laughs> it is very cheeky okay i'm not wearing this hair with all these swimsuits duh I'm gonna wear some curly hair or some wavy hair or my hair like in a clip. I don't know if y'all see me purchase those claw clips like with my hair like this with some sunglasses, like for instance, the sunglasses that I said I was gonna wear with this. Obviously it doesn't look good with the swimsuit, but it looks good with the cover up. So say if I take off the cover up, yes, I'm that crazy. <laughs> If I take off the cover up, I'm gonna switch to sunglasses. So for instance, I'll probably switch it to these. Y'all seen these before. These glasses. Just keep it simple since I'm wearing black slides. See what I'm saying? Yeah. Next swimsuit. I think this is gonna be the last one. Okay, yeah. Where's my eyeglasses? Put my blue light, turn my blue light glass on. So this is the final swimsuit. And this one is very, very classy. It's full coverage. It covers everything. It doesn't show any side hip. It has cutouts, but the cutouts are placed to the front. So it gives me some shape. And this is a full coverage top. Now I, I would have gotten a smaller top, but it's okay because it's still not showing any breasts. So I'm definitely wearing this one the first day that I'm on my trip. So let me show y'all the swimsuit. Okay, so y'all see this one? This one right here is very, very classy. It makes me look like I have a little tummy, but I don't, but who cares? But this is very, very classy. Y'all see what a cutout's at? They're kind of towards the front a little bit. They're not on the sides and they're not too extreme. And this reminds me of like pinup girl style. So I'm definitely gonna wear my hair up like, I'll show y'all, but I'm definitely gonna wear my hair up in a claw clip. And the cover up that I was gonna wear with it, cover up that I was gonna wear with it, I'm going to color block and wear like this hot pink um, button down that I got from H&M. I wear this so many different ways. I've been wearing this to like, um, I wore this to work before. This is a size US 18, this is a oversized. I wanted it bigger, but I've been wearing this to work, tucked in some jeans, some slacks with some skirts and stuff, but I'm definitely going to wear this, um, like, you know, either as a shirt or make it a skirt. And this is the hat that I'm going to wear with it. You see what I'm saying? Y'all don't know if y'all know the vibe that I'm going for. I'm going for a pinup girl look. Anyway, like I was saying, I'm going for a pinup girl look with this one too, because it's giving me very classy it's giving me family it's giving me take your kids to the water park it's nothing wrong with this one so i love it so and yeah and i got this from walmart and i don't know the price of that h m uh button down because i've had it for about six years i want to say the hat i got from i don't see the tag but i don't think i purchased it i think i purchased this probably from it's giving DDs. I think I purchased this from DDs. Glasses that I'll wear with it. Since it's like a pinup style swimsuit, I'll probably wear my little cat eyes. Isn't that so cute? Cause cat eyes was in style back then. That's how I remember them. I vividly remember cat eyes being in style in the 60s. So I would definitely wear these glasses. 
find this very, very cute. And like I said, I would wear my hair up. Y'all see that? I would wear my hair up in a claw clip style. And I just think that is so cute. Oh, by the way, the earrings I'm wearing, I'm wearing my cancer earrings that I got from, I don't know, I think from Miss A. Oh, Miss A. I got these from Miss A. And these glasses, I told y'all I got these from Miss A. So that is it for the swimsuits. So yeah, y'all, I hope y'all enjoyed my swimsuit trial haul, the, my weekend adventures. I told y'all I wasn't going to no club. I just took me an at-home virus test. I didn't want to say the C word, vid test. And that's negative. And I also have another test coming up, um, my real test for my results, like my actual uh Tesco, my trip is coming up in the next couple of days. I'm going to be doing some other maintenance things. Which swimsuit did I try on today that y'all liked? Okay. Also, what was your favorite cover-up? Um, what else? And y'all seen my sunglasses. Which sunglasses were your favorite? I mean, obviously, y'all didn't see them on my face. I didn't do a sunglass try on haul. I don't know if y'all want me to do that. I'll do that when I'm on the vacation. I didn't try all of them. I have 14 swimsuits laying there. 13 or 14. I think it's 13. I ain't about to try 13. Y'all already seen three in my first vlog. Um, trial haul. And y'all seen three in this one. Was it three or four in this one? I think it was four. But these are the nails I'm probably going to wear first. These are from Five Below. Or I might wear these. They're all over the place. <laughs> but I'll insert a picture of what these look like. These are from LA Colors. These are very, very sturdy as well. The Nail Frill, LA Colors Nail Frill, 33 piece. These are sturdy. Very, very sturdy, because I have these in purple, like the purple onion nails that I used to wear. In my first vlogs, I used to call them purple, purple onions. But these right here, they're kind of like this leopard print with lime green. I'm sorry if they're all over the place. I'll insert a picture, sorry or these five belows but i'm gearing towards these the first day only because i'm probably going to be wearing this swimsuit and this uh cover up so that goes and yes i know they press on and you like you gonna switch your nails yes i'm probably gonna switch my nails so we're gonna end the vlog here but thank you guys for clicking on my face again uh, make sure you guys like comment subscribe share these videos share these videos Share this video with your friends and family. I really appreciate y'all. We on the road to 350 subscribers. So I appreciate for I appreciate y'all for 300 subscribers. I really appreciate where I am right now. I'm getting to, like I said, therapy has been working for your girl. I said that in my last vlog and I said that in the vlog before that. We're doing, we're on the up and up mentally, you know, so. And I'm really liking what I'm doing in the, in the YouTube game right now, so very proud of myself but yeah let me get off of that let me get on back down to, to let me humble myself uh, <laughs> but yeah y'all i hope that y'all tune into the next vlog because that will be my vacation vlog i just want to let you guys know i'm going on a break because i'm gonna be on vacation enjoying the vacation so i won't be worrying about work I will, and I'm talking about, this is work. So I'm talking about YouTube. I'll be away from YouTube for about a week. So when y'all see this vlog, just know that the next week after this vlog is posted, it will not be any videos, but look out for a video um, the second week in August. Yeah, because August 1st is a Monday. That whole week, like August 1st through 9th, I'm gonna be on a break. So just wanna let you guys know that. But anyway, let me get on to packing. Because I got a lot to pack. And I showed y'all that I had to fit all 13 swimsuits in this Shein bag. So I'm going to see if my daughter got another Shein bag because I don't think none of these are going to, I don't think all of them going to fit in here. Y'all gonna find out on a vacation vlog if all them swimsuits fit in here. Y'all think they all them swimsuits gonna fit in here? 13 swimsuits? If I wrap them up good? Not the cover-ups, the swimsuits. Y'all think if I... I don't know, y'all. Let me handle this off camera and I'll see y'all on the next video. Bye! Mentally none of this shit can fade I came out of trenches, I really made it I came out the water, I really made it I stack on the water, I gotta save it
Shout out, you gotta say Shoot out the bar, no lovey-dovey These bitches, they looking for